Alright guys, we're back here with Bio not Bioshock. Fallout 4. We're actually just about inside of Diamond City. Literally just about. Now we are inside Diamond City. What do you mean you can't open the gate? I thought I should get here. I guess mm -hmm. this is Diamond this City. Be open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, Who is this a lady? Scary reporter. <laughs> I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. Really? <sighs> you open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. Danny, open up! You, you want into Diamond City, right? Yes. I just got here, but yeah. I got some new armor. And some new weapons. What's that? You said you're a trader up in Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? You hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. Let me make it personal. That was easy, bro. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on with the bluff. You first. Wouldn't have it any other way. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that a statement used to be should I, should I stick mayor. around? Shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? Do you support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. Um, not this my business. This really isn't any of my business. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome huh, thanks. I stole one of your guards' of outfit because he died Safe, while fighting mut happy, mutants a with fine me. Place to come. Spend your money. Settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, huh? All right. This hasn't been the friendliest welcome. He's got you there, McDonough. Guess not everyone gets won over by that sharp smile. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? Yes, actually. Um, I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? My son. Might as well tell him, fuck. He's less than a year old. Wait, your son's missing? Oh, you hear that, McDonough? What's Diamond City Security doing to help this man, huh? This isn't the first missing persons report to come through here, and now we have an infant who's been taken? No, don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through, huh? Confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service. Yeah, missing demand. boy is a pretty one big one, but I mean, surely find the time to help. with the creatures around. Yeah. I guess we'll see. This is ridiculous. Diamond City security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonald. What's the real reason security never investigates in I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Hmm, <laughs> a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. Who Did is this chick? She cute, but I mean, I, I like, who is she? I settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. Really? Well, I've never been to Diamond City yet, so let's go see what it's. Ooh, a death ball. 
Isn't he just beautiful? I like the thick tail on him. Looks nice. The spikes on his back as well. Looks real nice. Mayor McDougal, McDung, whatever, I don't care. Why, th why is this place so bright and pink? Where's my, my game's glitching. Why is my game glitching? That's weird. Who's this? Well, hello. Free paper to newcomers. If the institute grabs you in the night, at least be warned. Ha! <laughs> nice. Thanks. I guess. I'm serious. The institute takes people. You should read up if you're sticking around. The institute? The institute? You ain't heard of the institute, mister? They snatch people up in the night and no one hears from them again. It's all in the paper. Better read up before they grab you, too. <sighs> sure, whatever. Hey, it's that girl. Who's gone missing? Drifters, residents, stadium seat snobs. Seems every year or so. Someone's gone. And we all know why. So you better be careful now. Institute is out, and they'll grab you too. Really? Like I said, it's all in the paper. All right, little one. I believe you. Thanks. You are a real lost lamb in the wolf's den, Mister. So what are you doing in Diamond City anyway? Um, just hoping to find something. Yeah, you and every scaver in the colony. So what are you looking for, huh? Who would I talk to about finding a missing person? You're in bad luck. No one tries to find missing people in Diamond City. Missing people means the Institute is involved. Uh huh. And no one's going to want to get the Institute attention. Yeah, no. You're a smart kid. Isn't there someone in town who isn't afraid of this Institute? Well, there is the detective, Mr. McValentine. He's not afraid of anything. If anyone's gonna help you, it's him. Good to know, thanks. What else do you know about Mr. Valentine? I know all the- Okay, let's hurry up. Thanks. You were a big help. Remember, the Institute's out there, newcomer. Watch your back. Yeah, I will, no worries. <laughs> Excuse me. Hey, kiddo. How are the paper sales? Well, the presses are getting overloaded. That motor is going to go soon if we don't replace it. Nah, uh, you've been saying that for weeks and the old girl still keeps cranking. Stop worrying so much. I gotta head into the office. Maybe start whistling if you see any angry politicians coming our way. Why? Is something wrong? Piper? <gasps> Piper? Should we chat with her? We'll talk more once I get settled in. Okay, get settled in then. Am I just not allowed? Okay, now I can open it. Where's this girl? There she is. Piper. Holding up, Blue? Yeah. Why are you calling me that? Because you're a vault dweller. I know you're not wearing a blue jumpsuit right now, but the pit boy and that fish out of water look. Dead giveaways. So here's the deal I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time down the city had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. Yeah, I don't really... I don't really care to have you with me. You look pretty weak. I mean, like, you're cute, but you look weak. Sure. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? My family and I were frozen. 
I didn't spend much time with Paul. Wait. <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Yep. Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yep. Yes. I'm over 200 years old. <laughs> oh my god. The man out of time. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? <laughs> I've been having too much fun blowing things up to think about. Gotta make my job hard for me, huh? Alright, if that's the quote, that's the quote. Now I already know you're looking for your son, Sean. Do you suspect the Institute is involved in his kidnapping? I don't really know the Institute, but it sounds like it. Sure sounds like it might be. Not even a baby is safe from him. And people wonder why I can't just look the other way. See, but... the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I have a theory. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the comments. See, because... You saw your what kid you get stolen, lost a loved one, but, might be too scared or too numb to the but you fell way. back asleep. So, how old is the kid now? Because, like, how long were you back asleep for? Find who's responsible and make them pay. Simple as that. I'll take anger over apathy any day. Good quote. Thanks, Bill. No worries, everything. Pink. It's I would call take you Pink. Some time to put this all together, but I think your story is going to be done in the city plenty of times. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. I'll hey, have you come with me. Let's see what she has. Press cap. Road leathers. Sure, let's go. Well did. Does that mean the dog's not with I'm me anymore? Sorry, boy. Time for you to head home. What? Aw, the boy the dog leaves? That's a little sad. Goodbye, dog meat. I love you. Dog meat's been with us or with me for so long. It's big, loud, corrupt officials and and citizens. Aw, his head's down. I love you, boy. But like she cute. She fine. Anyone is one of those things. It's Pop. that secretary of the I ain't telling you how to pick your friends. Nice bat. Piper's kind of a trouble. Really? Hi there. Bye bye, just an ordinary piece of wood. A spotter is a custom made piece of wood. Thirsty. Doctor says I can't drink liquor no more. I hear there's a bar in the old theater that's for the Raiders only. Um. Diamond City right here. So, I'm in like the town district, I guess. Schoolhouse. That's cool. They have a schoolhouse. Oh, a kitty? I heard a kitty. Find them. Hello? Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I didn't come here to get brushed off. Well, you can take a seat and wait for the next Armageddon. Because the detective ain't coming back. He's gone missing. Nikki's missing. What has he gotten I guess we're gonna save time? the detective. Don't worry. I can help. Tell me what happened. Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. 
I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Huh. Hey, I'd love to help, but there's a small matter of expenses. Don't play games with me. I'll pay you if you find Nick, but it's going to be a hundred caps. That's the reward, and it's not up for negotiation. Ouch. What a dick. I'll find him. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please, hurry. Yeah, whatever. Hey. What can I do? Piper. Something neat? Oh, it's just like chatting. Is everything all right between us, Piper? Look, you don't need to worry. You're fine, I guess. I just... I want to do right by folks out here. I need to know what you do too. Yeah, I do. Your thoughts? Anything I can do? You just say the word. Wait, is everything okay between us? It's hard to so we have to build a relationship. Can I get her to like, I think like me, like me? Because like, like she cute. That's all. Sure. Because like, yeah, she cute. So to get her to like me, I need to help people. <laughs> Oh, I'm such a fucking weirdo. Alright, so where could this guy be? He's way over here. also have um the brotherhood of steel up not episode the brotherhood of steel quests i can do i wasn't sure if i should i started it but obviously i wasn't gonna like start it started join them off camera that would be a lot i just did the i didn't even realize it was starting the brotherhood of steel quest line it was just a radio thing had to respond to a frequency radio frequency you guys know how it is <sighs> well hope you guys are having fun with this game now that I'm actually into it it's been a bit more fun I, I tend to have a hard time starting these games takes me a while to get into a game like this but yeah this one's been pretty good um I'm gonna shoot this guy in the head oh. City, just follow the signs. Let's go. I'd rather not piss off the town, so I'm just not gonna pickpocket them. Seriously, bro? There we go. There! Okay, come on, stop this shit. 
Um, we're gonna go with more locksmith. I can't. bitch going. Headshots, bud. Come on. Are you for real? missing that like legit Too close and personal. What is this? A gauntlet of some sort? Looks like you'd put your hand in this end and then punch them with this end. Looks pretty cool. Pretty painful. Pretty fucking heavy though. Like, the thing around your arm itself looks too heavy to lift. Come on, loading screen, hurry the frig up. Oh, we're way back here. Oh, that sucks. Might as well let this take him out. 
Let's try out this junk jet. I got it, and I've never tried it. Let's just try this. Ha! That's pretty fucking cool, actually. What is it that I'm shooting? Just everything? fucking hit him. This isn't as accurate as I thought it could be, but it's still fun. Ow! The car blew up. That hurt. Well, good thing I was just messing around that time. It's a nice gun. I like those ones. Looks dope. Let's see if I can just fast travel somewhere close. Wait, what's this? Find Nick Valentine. Oh. Follow the Freedom Trail. Yeah, I did some Minutemen quests and now they're going to raid the castle. This is that. Uh, Um, yeah, yeah, lots of stuff I can do. Which is good. I like a game with lots of stuff I can do. It's exactly how a game should be. Come on, loading screen. Ooh. This is where I first saw the fucking mutants. Is it? Oh no, maybe not. I watched them walk up that way. Okay. Well... I'm actually going to cut off this video here. If you guys liked it, leave... Shit. 
shit, shit, shit. There were some mutants. <laughs> but if you guys like this episode, leave a like if you want to see more. <coughs> uh, excuse me. If you want to see more, please subscribe. But this has been Follow. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.